Hello, today I'm going to be showing you another package I got. Um, so this one, oh my gosh, so I finally found this on Twitter, and so there, these are these Pokemon plushes, these are like my dream Pokemon plushes, I've always wanted these, and I'm just so glad to finally have found them, so I found a seller on Twitter, and let me just, so you don't have like the cryogonal, I actually might not know, but I have like a cryogonal plush, I have a masculine plush, I'll show you them, and they are the Van Presto plushes, so I wanted to collect like some of Van Presto plushes, they're really small, uh, they're like keychain sized, and I don't have a lot of them of course. But then, uh, this one, these are two Pokemon, I really could not find them anywhere on the internet. And I'm so glad I finally found them. And so, the seller on Twitter was, like, showing me how they had, like, some header selling Pokemon plushes. I'm gonna take these away. And they happen to have, okay, so, this one actually has two plushes. So, Clink Clang was the main one I wanted. And now I have Kling Clang, a Kling Clang plush. It's so weird. It's like the only plush part, or the only like non felt part is the gear, the big gear in the middle. And then I also got the Clang plush because it was like, objectively though, they, this is like inferior to this because this one actually has the gear. You know, Clang's always been awkward. Like, this is even less detailed, because, like, the circle's smaller, and then the face is just printed on instead of, like, layered. But, yeah. So, we have a Clink Clang plush. We have a Clang plush. What else? And then, the seller was also, had, like, Tomy figures, and I don't really collect Tomy figures that much anymore, but there's, like, one I was just interested in, and then I got a Toxic Crow, and the seller included, like, a lot of things I didn't ask for either, but it was really nice of him. Thank you, seller. Here we go, so, and this was expensive, this was like $51 after, it was like from Spain. So here is the Toxicroak Plush, oh shoot, or not plush, Tommy figure. Uh, I might do a review on this later. Uh, yeah, I always, and then I also got Toxicroak uh, Bandai figure, which is, uh, that was not expected, but yeah, the so Toxic Croak Bandai figure. And then a lot of Pokemon cards, so some of them were just kind of there to hold in the tags. Because the tags are in really good quality. Because yeah, some people like <laughs> tags together. It might be a little upsetting not having the tags together, but... it Like, I'm not a collector, I just like... Or I, I guess I'm a collector, but... And, yeah, they gave me a lot of Pokemon cards, too. So, not really, like, you know, the most exciting Pokemon cards, but they are cool cards. Uh, oh, yeah. Like, I didn't, I didn't buy the cards, that's not why. So, we got, like, a Foil, Glamio, Inkay, Bellsprout, Ry oh, right on. Ooh, Manaphy, look at this. Nice. Tynamo, a Lowland Grimer. Ooh, so Charmander, Charmeleon, Garchomp. So they have cars. Is this like from Spain? Oh, they're from Spain! Look at this! Like, they, they, this is in Spanish because the United you know, Silver is from Spain. Oh my gosh, I didn't even notice that. But look at that. Look, this is. Well, some of them are in English, but then this, this one's not in English. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what else? Like this was okay. I asked. Uh, it's cool. It's cool. I I'm just gonna show you the rest. Like yeah. So yeah, here's like everything really. Nothing, nothing too big, but yeah. And uh, they show you this. Uh, like a bee, a melted bee, uh, toxic croak. That's nice. Yeah, not that much, but like, you know, this is, this is something I've been wanting for a while. And then this, okay, well this is kind of just something I got to decide for this. And then this guy, this is a new thing, okay. Yeah, 